Hi guys. It is a gray, gloomy, rainy, yuck, depressing, slit your wrist kind of day here in the end times. <sighs> Back at Bugs in a Jar Farm, uh, little dog and I have been away for a few days enjoying the leaf show in Vermont, but we are back to the doom and gloom here. Uh, it is Thursday, where are we, October 13th, 2022, I believe, and so, uh, you know, going through the mainstream media, actually this is those little lefties over at Common Dreams, so I've been uh, out of out of touch for a few days trying to enjoy it while I still can but I see all sorts of stories on this one uh, in the mainstream and the lefty media hallelujah and then I'm gonna come back I'm just gonna touch on this story then uh, look at the bigger we're gonna break it down as I think Alex Jones we're gonna Take a look at this story, and then we're going to break it down. What is going on this week in the life of far-right conspiracy grifter Alex Jones? There you go. Is hit with nearly $1 billion in damages for Sandy uh, Hook lies. Uh... Quote, the man is a destructive, deceitful, and lethal menace. Let these damages crush him under the weight of his own lies. That was the head of Media Matters for America. Anyway, a Connecticut jury on Wednesday ordered far-right conspiracy theorist Alex Jones to pay nearly one billion dollars to people, including relatives of victims of the 2012 Sandy Hook Elementary School Massacre, who endured relentless threats and harassment as the InfoWars owner repeatedly claimed, quote, the shooting was a hoax staged by crisis actors. Yes. Uh, anyway, obviously, uh, you know, Alex Jones just laughing off this $965 million uh, penalty that we will see. But, you know, it is going to, it is going to make him a little bit uh, butt hurt. Uh, Let's see. Anyway, uh, said Jones after the ruling, why not make it trillions? Do these people actually think they're getting any of this money? Jones then implored his supporters to buy his overpriced dietary supplements. <laughs> Quote, they want to scare us away from questioning Uvalde or Parkland, uh, Jones added. Uh, we are not going away. We are not going to stop. To that, Fred Gutenberg, whose 14-year-old daughter Jamie was one of 17 people murdered during the uh, Parkland uh, school shooting replied, quote, if Alex Jones intends to now question Parkland, bring it on. Alex Jones is a scum-sucking, low-life dirtbag who deserves his own place in hell. That is exactly what Alex Jones is and what he deserves. And uh, so anyway, I can, I guess I can uh, not just let this one go uh, right on by. Okay, guys, 
Uh, I 100% uh, agree with that description of Alex Jones. He is a scum, a scum sucking dirt bag, low life, lying sack of shit who deserves his own place in hell. Uh, he deserves that nine hundred and sixty-five million dollar uh, judgment against him. Uh, he deserves every bit of ridicule anybody with a brain can heap on him. I uh, I agree one hundred percent with that. That Alex Jones is the same kind of low life, dirt sucking scumbag. Uh, you know, uh, he's the same ilk as Donald Trump. Uh, I, I, I despise the ground Alex Jones walks on. Uh, all of that aside, uh, I do not think that uh, Alex Jones or Donald Trump or any uh, one of these lying sacks of shit uh, should be uh, you know, pulled down off of YouTube or whatever. Uh, now, if they are caught in their bold-faced lies, uh, they deserve whatever. But for, for some reason, I don't quite understand. I still try to uh, hold on to this fantasy that anybody... Uh, with, with one brain cell can listen to this unadulterated horseshit coming out of Alex Jones's mouth or Donald Trump's mouth or whatever and decide for themselves uh, you, you know uh, it, it, how big of a lying sack of shit they are and what kind of punishment they deserve. Uh, because as soon as you start censoring, uh, you know, the, a, a couple of things. You know, number one, it just gives more ammunition to these clueless fucking morons who believe this. They say, see, he's obviously telling the truth because he's being censored. So all you're going to do is feed the, the clueless fucking morons. All you're doing is feeding morons by, uh, quote, censoring these guys. And then, of course, uh, the bigger fear is that, you know, if they take down Alex Jones or Donald Trump or whoever, uh, you know, what do they, you think they're going to do? Uh, with, with some irritating, lightweight, little whiny gnat like Hambone Little Tail or, or anybody else you know down here uh, speaking the truth about what's going on on the planet. Uh, you know, what, what is, where do they draw the line? If, if they can yank Alex Jones and Donald Trump and his ilk down from YouTube and uh, Twitter and all the rest of them, uh, they they can sure as shit yank down, uh, you know, some pipsqueak uh, like me or you. If, if if you were someone down here in the Doomosphere with one of these channels, I, I cannot believe that anybody with a YouTube channel would uh, support uh, YouTube yanking down. The, the channel of another YouTuber. But, but anyway, uh, the, the bigger picture in all of this is, uh, you know, that, that nobody is talking about. I, I have never, I've, I've probably looked at about a dozen of these articles uh, on the lefty and the mainstream uh, media. Now, I haven't gone to look how Fox and the right are reporting this story, but I don't think you're going to find this angle there. And that's, uh, you know, what the fuck? Uh, I, while I'm in full support uh, of Alex Jones, uh, you know, getting deemed 
for one billion dollars for spreading this unadulterated fucking uh, horse shit. Why isn't uh, everybody else spreading this unadulterated horse shit being uh, fined a billion dollars? I can go up and down the, the fucking mainstream media every day. I can go up and down the mainstream media. I can uh, go up and down the limp dick lefty media. And, and I can go up and down uh, you know, the right wing um, from Fox News to the alt right. And, and, and I can show you example after example after example after example of unadulterated horseshit. Uh, just complete fucking lies being trumpeted uh, all across uh, the fucking mainstream media, social media, YouTube. Uh, there's probably more lies uh, from all sides being uh, being pushed, and and, and nobody's. Uh, nobody is getting a billion dollar fine for it except uh, Alex Jones. If you find fucking Alex Jones uh, one billion dollars for this shit, you know, go find Elon Musk one trillion dollars for all of his horse shit spewing out of his fucking mouth about there, there, there's not enough people being born on this planet, that we're going to have a city of one million people on Mars in 30 years, all of this shit. And you know why? You know, I'm not every single day of the fucking year uh, aren't uh, these bright green liars. Uh, all of these people talking this unadulterated fucking horse shit uh, on, on, on either side of it, uh, wh whether it's fossil fuels or uh, the cure for fossil fuels, all, all of those bright green lies, the fucking uh, lion sacks of shit uh, coming out, uh, you know, from the fossil fuel supporters, uh, which are no less egregious than uh, the fucking uh, unadulterated horse shit, bright green lies coming out of these little limp dick lefties, you know, talking about how a bunch of fucking, uh, you know, electric vehicles and, and, and fucking uh, windmills and solar panels uh, are, are going to save this planet like we uh, transition from fossil fuels, which is one big fucking lie in itself, uh, worthy of a one billion dollar fine. Right there is a fucking lie, and, and that we're even going to do it. And, and then uh, an even bigger lie is, is the fucking lie is if we do uh, get off of fossil fuels, uh, that we're going. Uh, you know, that we're going to save the fucking planet with all of these bright green lies shit. It's all a fucking pack of lies. It's, it, it, it's the biggest fucking pack of unadulterated horse shit, lying sacks of shit. Uh, you know, they're running this planet. Uh, they're, they're running the, the mainstream media, the limp dick lefty media. Uh, the fucking Nazi right-wing media is, is a bunch of lying sack of shit propaganda for all intents and purposes uh, is it, full of shit. It, it, it's that shit coming out uh, about Sandy Hook uh, out of Alex Jones's uh, fat fucking mouth. You know, every motherfucking politician is spouting these unadulterated horseshit lies. Every fucking politician on this fucking planet should have a $1 billion 
uh, judgment thrown against them. Every motherfucking corporate CEO on this planet uh, is every bit as much of a as much of a lying sack of shit is that fat ass piece of shit Alex Jones. They're, you know, uh, they're laughing all the way to the fucking bank while uh, Alex Jones is being turned into this sacrificial lamb. Uh, you know, acting like uh, liars, people peddling bullshit are, are, are going to be, uh, you know, are going are gonna to be somehow silenced and reined in or whatever. That's another big fucking lie. Whoever promoting the lie uh, that throw in this billion dollar well deserved uh, fine at Alex Jones uh, m means that they're putting on alert uh, all, all the other fucking liars on the planet. Anyone promoting that big fucking lie is as much of a lying sack of shit as Alex Jones is. It ain't gonna put any of these fucking lying sacks of shit uh, on, on on red alert. If it could happen to if it could happen to Alex Jones, uh, it, it it could happen to uh, I I don't know the fucking CEO of of Chevron or whoever. You know, pick your fucking poison. Fucking bullshit. Uh, it, it ain't gonna mean shit. Uh, not one of these goddamn other uh, lion sacks of shit uh, who are a lot bigger danger to this fucking planet uh, than Alex Jones and, and his little clueless moron fucking little minions will ever be. Uh, Alex, the, the lies that Alex Jones are spreading uh, are absolutely minuscule as, 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 as completely, you know, as atrocious as they are, uh, how anybody, uh, can listen to the shit coming out of that fat fucker's mouth. Uh, they are the ones, uh, who are a bigger danger than, uh, than fucking Alex Jones. It, it, it's these people, uh, believing these fucking lies. You know, these little fucking limp dick lefties, uh, like fucking AO, the AOC gang, uh, you know, acting like these fucking uh, energy transition is, is, is going to save the planet. Uh, anybody believe in this fucking uh, lying little bitch AOC uh, who deserves a fucking one billion dollar uh, fine thrown at her for her lying. Uh, there, anybody believe in those fucking lies or every bit as fucking clueless as, as any clueless fucking moron Alex Jones uh, ass licking toady believe in this unadulterated horse shit uh, about Sandy Hook. Pull your fucking head out of your ass, people. They're all a bunch of fucking lying sacks of shit. Alex Jones, uh, you know, it was easy to, you know, easy to throw the lasso over. Anyway, I just had to make that little uh, amplification and clarification about the Alex Jones story. But that out of the way, uh, the little dog and I, uh, we need to head to the laundromat and uh, hopefully for the last time get bugs in a jar to wash sheets for the Airbnb which shuts down in one month. And uh, so I am going to do the single most depressing thing a human being can do and that's go to a laundromat on a rainy day get out there and go to a laundromat on a rainy day while you still can. Bye guys. Jesus Christ.
Oh yeah. It is a lovely day. A lovely day to head to a laundromat. Bye guys.